We need to get out there and do what we can for Mantle. We need to do what we can for everyone. What about Amity? And telling the world about Salem? We can't do this alone. We need help. Ruby's right. The Happy Huntresses are handling the evacuation better than we could. And there's a bigger picture. But Amity isn't even finished. It was still under construction. Ruby, there is no way Ironwood will cooperate with us. But he doesn't have to. We just need the green light from his terminal, right? You want to go back to the Academy? What you're saying is it can't be done. It's pointless. And even if you got the message out, there's no guarantee help would come. It's not pointless. Atlas is only Salem's current target. She's not hiding anymore, and once she's done here, she'll move on to the rest of Remnant. We need to warn them! Ruby, when we came here, we said we'd follow your lead. But things haven't exactly worked out. I just... Okay, okay. Then let's go for both. Get Amity up and running and evacuate Mantle. But that's how Salem got this far, by dividing us. We have to stick together. Nobody's turning you over to anybody. I think that's the one thing we could all agree on. <sighs> okay. Then I guess we're going to Atlas. Hey, we're still united. I hope so. I do not like it when friends fight. I know. I... Yang and I might not agree on how best to save Mantle, no. but... To be honest, I wasn't sure how you'd be doing without all of your teammates. Well, as you can see, we're doing just fine. Ruby? I hope everyone's doing all right. If you're worried about Yang, you could always try calling her. But that's the thing. I did. Night and day I've waited for the moment When I'd see your face and feel you near I missed you too. So then, it's impossible. See? If Miss Hero, with all the answers, doesn't have an answer, then we have ours. Shut up! Okay, then why don't you just leave? Can we please... All of this doubt and worry and distrust, it isn't getting us anywhere. Then nothing has changed! We're in the exact same place we were yesterday! Arguing over what to do while the kingdom waits to die! <sighs> You know, that giant hound kicked us around like we were nothing. But Blake said you and the Chinese managed to take it down. Still having to one-up your big sis, huh? Did she tell you what it was? Underneath? Yeah. You know what that means, then. I wouldn't worry about that. That's what happened to Mom. When I saw its eyes, I knew. Salem used to kill people with silver eyes, like Maria. But she's always wanted me alive. Why would that change unless... When she met Mom, she learned she could do something new. Ruby. We shouldn't lie to ourselves. I wasted our time getting Amity up, thinking help would come, but it didn't. And Amity fell. I was being childish. You were being optimistic. Look, blind optimism isn't great, but no optimism means we've already lost. We need hope. We need to take risks. But mine didn't work. It's still got a warning out. Ruby, they're not called sure things. They're called risks. And in case you didn't notice, my plan for Mantle didn't work either. But we got Oscar back. 
and did a lot more that was never in the plan. Mom took a risk the day she left, and I don't think... I don't think it went the way she wanted it to. But she's still my hero. Hurry! Did I stop the virus? Go ahead. Maybe we could use it to save Penny and get everyone in Atlas and Mantle back to safety. I, uh, Mr. Ambrosius, uh, sir, listen, it's about our friend. She's, she's dying. Parts out of her. That would leave. I guess you just have to get creative. Do not fall. Okay, and with that dire warning. Suppose <laughs> I have all of you to thank for one last lesson. Sometimes, if you want to win, you simply can't do it alone. Ruby! Yay. <laughs>